Hi everyone, welcome back to another video in the Web Security Academy series. In today's video, we'll be covering lab number eight in the broken access control module titled user ID controlled by request parameter with unpredictable user IDs. All right, let's get started. This lab has a horizontal privilege escalation vulnerability on the user account page, but identifies users with GUIDs. I believe that stands for global unique IDs. To solve the lab, find the GUID for Carlos and submit his API key as the solution. You can log into your own account using the following credentials, and these are the credentials that we were given. All right, so the target goal over here is to find the GUID of the Carlos user and then compromise his account. Let's access the lab. All right, the page loaded. Now notice that I'm using the built-in browser in the Burp proxy, and so all my requests are already getting sent to Burp. So if we look at the page, it seems like it's some kind of um, blogging page, and we have a My Account functionality where we could log in with the credentials that we were given. So let's log in with that. Hit login. We get the same page that we've been seeing in previous applications. So the username is right over here and the API key is right over here. Now, if I click on my account, notice over here, the ID is not something that is predictable or something that I could guess or brute force. So that's what a global user identifier is. And what that means is also that I can't uh, figure out what the other users GUIDs are. So in order to access another user's account, I would need to figure out what their ID is. And that would have to be leaked somewhere in the application for me to see that. So let's go to the home page and just look at some of the posts. So you could see over here, um, the post is written by the administrator account and you're able to select the account that wrote the post. So if I select it over here and I look at the request that was made by the application, you could see that it actually leaks the user ID of the account that wrote the post. So this is the user ID for the administrator user. However, if you look at the target goal right over here, it is to compromise the Carlos user. So let's go back and see if there's a post that is written by the Carlos user. So let's see the second one. And here we go. The second one is written by the Carlos user. If I click on that, I should get the user ID for the Carlos user. So I'm gonna copy that and then see if I could access the user's account. So let's send this to repeater. Over here, we're with the user that we were given. Now let's replace that with the GUID of the Carlos user. Hit send and look for Carlos. And here we go. We're logged in as the Carlos account and we get the API key of the Carlos user. So let's copy that and submit that as a solution. Hit OK. And we get a congratulations, you solved the lab. All right, so we successfully completed the exercise by exploiting the vulnerability manually. Now let's script it in Python. If you would like to see a detailed version of the video where we first exploit the vulnerability manually and then script it in Python, check out the video linked on the screen. Also make sure to hit the subscribe button and check out my course if you're interested in seeing more videos like this one. Thank you and see you in the next video.